Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we are talking about Venmo and more specifically, I'm going to quickly answer a question. I keep getting a lot on my other video and that is how do you set up a passcode for your Venmo? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, real quick video, not too many steps involved. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video, but why would you want to set up a passcode into your Venmo anyways? Well, that's pretty easy. If you're running a business and someone else has access to your phone, you know that it is a popular scam to use your phone and then quickly transfer money from your Venmo into their account and to help prevent that by adding a passcode, it can limit the chances of that happening. Whatever the case is, it's a pretty easy process. It's handled here in your Venmo. It's this blue and white app here on the top left. Check my video description. I'll try to leave the written instructions there as well, but I'm going to go ahead and open my Venmo app now. Okay, guys, I went ahead and opened my Venmo app. This is the home screen. Now here on the home screen, if you want to add a passcode into your Venmo, you need to click on your profile icon down here on the bottom right. Once you click there, you will see more information about your Venmo account. And in order to add a passcode, click on this gear icon here on the top right. All right, once you do that, you're going to see a drop down menu and you want to look for this line right here called face ID and pin. It looks kind of like a little fingerprint. Okay, so here is where you can add a pin number into your Venmo. So as you can see right here, it says enable face ID and pin. Mine is gray and white. So you need to scroll that over. And once it's green, it's going to let you go ahead and choose a password. So I'm going to go ahead and enter a four digit passcode now. Okay. I entered in my passcode and it's asking me to enter it in once again. Okay. Once you enter in the passcode, if you have a thumbprint ID or a face ID, you can go ahead and enable that as well. For me, I want to go ahead and turn that on. So I'm going to go ahead and click allow. Okay. And just a quick second later, the page refreshes. Now you can see my pin option is now green. So now when I go to log in, into my Venmo and the app is opened, it's going to ask for my pin or at least my face ID. Also, sometimes Venmo will ask for your pin code when you're doing transactions like sending out money. So there you have it, guys. If you're wondering how to add a passcode into your Venmo, that's the easiest way I know how to do it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel and I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.